Expendables 2, Mr. Church reunited the Expendables for what should be an easy paycheck, but one of their men is murdered on the job, and their quest for revenge puts them to deep in enemy territory and evidence and unexpected threats. Okay. When I was d typing the title and the description, my Paranorman review, I was thinking, I said at the end of my Paranorman review that it's Venables 2 was better. No, I didn't run it. I like Paranorman more, but is it's Venables 2 a bad movie? Then? No! It's Venables 2 is awesome. I mean, I'm not sure if I like the. I think. I'm not sure if I like the first movie or the second movie better. I mean. Yeah, I'm not sure if I like the first movie or the second movie better. But, um. The Expendables 2 was awesome. I mean. Seeing Chuck Norris and, um. And Arnold Schwarzenegger and Jason Statham and Sylvester Stallone. I mean being awesome in one movie. It was epic. And I loved it. I mean, there's not much to say about it. I mean, there's not much to say about it, but one thing I'm wondering is, why was Jet Li barely in it? But anyway, um, the reason I'm doing this is because, well, my brain is dented, and there's like a needle thing kind of in my teeth, and I look like it and keeps like stabbing my mouth and it hurts like crazy. I have to do this to get it out. So that's why he's been seeing me doing that. But anyway, my Spider-Man Two is awesome. Just go see it. If you love the first movie, you're gonna love this one. So just go see it. I mean, go see it.